hello good morning all today in this video we are going to discuss regarding how to install a module in database from the Odoo command line so currently in the screen you are seeing Odoo version 15 community edition and which i am running using the terminal so if i go to the pycharm here i have the terminal of the pycharm and if i click on Control c you can see the Odoo will be stopped and this is the command that I'm using to run Odoo. So what I'm going to do is that let me run it again. So I'll click on enter. And if I come to the UI, so we have recently created a database named test04 and we haven't installed any module. So let's see how we can install a couple of modules in this database from the terminal. So what I'll do is that I'll be installing the OM hospital module inside the test04 database. So in order to install OM hospital, I'll go to the terminal and I'll stop the current execution and I'll add minus D test 04 i'm saying i need to perform the operation inside the test 04 db and minus i so you have to specify minus i to the installing a module so i need to install minus i om hospital so i'll specify the module name here minus i om hospital and if i click on enter you can see the log it's installing some dependent modules like mail and you can see let's see whether this execution finish you can see it's installing the product module and here you can see om hospital module is getting installed now what i will do i'll go to the ui so currently it was not installed and if i refresh now you can see om hospital module has been installed in this database you can see hospital has been installed so in order to install a module just you have to pass minus i module name when you run the odoo so you can install multiple modules so in order to install multiple multiple modules you can just put comma separated list of module so we, before winding up this video what we will be doing is that we will try to install the account module that is invoicing and crm so the technical name of the invoicing is account and crm module is crm so let's go to the terminal and i'll put we need to install crm comma account so i just pass here minus i crm comma account and if i click on enter you can see the module is getting installed sales team portal everything is getting installed loading account module so it may take few time to install the account module so let's wait until the execution finish so you can see the account edi module is getting installed payment module crm is getting installed now account check printing so let's wait until all the dependencies and the specified module is installed so it seems the module has been installed now if i come to the ui and if i refresh you can see the invoicing and the crm has been installed in this database so i hope you understood this thing and i'll click on control I'll stop this execution and if I go to the run of the PyCharm so you may wonder how we can do the same from the PyCharm so in that case if you need to do the same from PyCharm configuration along with parameters you can pass minus D and if you put test 05 it will create a new database and if you need to install module you can pass the information here so if i put minus d test 05 over here apply click on ok you can see minus d test 05 it will create a new database in this provided name you can see the base module is getting installed and let me go to the ui and here we are running in port 8016 so let me Lock out 8016 here it is and if i go to the database manager you can see test 05 has been installed and if i log in to this instance here you can see if you need to install om hospital you can edit configuration you can put minus i om hospital this will install 
the hospital module inside this database so just minus d minus i so minus d to specify the database name and minus i to specify the module name that we need to install so let's see what happens once this execution finish the om hospital will be getting installed in this database so i hope you understood how we can create a database minus d db name and how to install a module in a database so that's it for the day if you like the video please do click the like button and support us by having a comment and sharing the video with your oru friends so that's it for the day have a nice day thank you